And this is one of the things you see when you're lying in bed at almost quarter past four in the morning on the day you're going to have an angioplasty. And over there is my heart rate and my pulse and my blood pressure. You know, my medication to thin my blood. I'm on nitroglycerin. I'm on saline. Well, it's morning and you can see the dawn. I'm awake because I got weighed at 4.30 a.m. and then at 6 a.m. they came in to draw blood. Why they couldn't weigh me at 7.30 and draw blood at 7.30 is unknown to me. Now 7.20 and I had an EKG. They're taking good care of me. I've had three procedures since uh, 5.30. I still am wondering though, as much as I appreciate the care, I'm wondering why they can't do it all at the same time. In my arm, that's the IV. And I have three bags of stuff. Nitroglycerin, Wemperin or something or other, and then saline. And somehow they get kinks in all these cords. And it goes beep, 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 beep. And then the nurse has to come in and press some buttons and it stops going beep, 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 beep. And it says no eating, drinking, not even water after midnight. And there's nothing wrong with my heart. And this is what the window looks like at 12.15. I think they took me down there around... 9 30 10 o'clock I can't remember now and they gave me some wonderful stuff that I must have slept through a lot of it because I think I was there an hour and it didn't seem like an hour so and they did my wrist and now I'm on bed rest or I can't move that wrist but this is what it looks like and chances are I won't have to take any of all that medication that I was on all night long um, what do you call it? I can't even remember what it is now. This is where I had the angiogram. That's where the doctor entered. He did not enter through my groin. So, I didn't feel a thing. They gave me something and they told me that it would give me amnesia. And it did because I don't remember anything, although I supposedly was awake for the whole procedure. I don't remember anything except the beginning and then being wheeled out. And supposedly I was a happy drunk. That's what they called me. Um, so I said silly things a lot, including to the doctor whose last name was Burke, Aaron Go Bra. And then I shouted as I left the room, I'm an Irish citizen, which I am. And then this is where the IV was. And with all the heart stuff I have, my heart should be happy for quite a while and nobody knows you know why I had the symptoms I had that led to the angiogram in the first place. There was no soap in the bathroom because I think they wanted to discourage me from taking a shower because they told me they didn't want me to. So I'm due for a shower 